So to make it start slow, you're gonna go into the settings, P7. That's at 200, so it's gonna start at 200. And then it's going to uh, go to uh, 1,000. I got it set at 1,000. You can change this to go faster, slower. And then the next step would be to go to P8. And P8 will tell you how many stitches it's going to start. So that's what we had it at. So if you wanted to go back to P1, I can put it to go faster, save it. So if I want to go back, go back to P1, bring it down, which that, which this is a really good sewing speed for upholstery. I wouldn't try to sew your machine faster than that, especially when it's new. So if you want to go back to P7, you want to start a faster start. You can do that. So that's the settings. You have your scissor with your presser foot and your scissor, I mean your presser foot with your scissors and uh, just the normal tacking setups. You can go in here and change them to what's stitch length. and stitch count that you want. The only thing I don't like about setting that up that you'll always get used to, if you use this a lot, you'll get used to just pressing the, the presser foot hard because you know it's gonna start slow. But you can override that by just keeping your foot down not too hard and that's the best way to do it so you don't develop a habit of always pressing down hard like right now I'll press down hard and it changes the speed good way to do it is just and then still after 12 you can press down hard